so my name's Ryan or Frost, as we call me at camp. Uh, camp's a, a lot of fun. You uh, get to experience the outdoors. It's it's a pretty pretty lit time. You get to go in the pool, work with kids, and I've been going for the past ten years. So that that should probably say something. My favorite thing about it is the variety of the environment. So you have like the garden area, you also have the forested area, the part of the creek where you can go and do dip netting. You have the orchards, you have the fields, so, so many different places where you can go and assess the environment in such a different way. And the kids have had the opportunity to do that too. Yeah, same thing. It's just everything that you go, everything comes together and you can sit out there on the picnic tables and you hear very little cars. And right now, we can hear tons of cars going by. It's nonstop. But out there, there's very little cars. There's green everywhere. You hear birds all the time. You can hear the cicadas, cicadas like nonstop. And it's just peaceful. And you'll hear kids running around laughing. You'll hear excitement and fun. It's just cool. It's just cool. <laughs> this is where Dave went to sleep and we put a handful of shaving cream in his hand and then we tickled his nose and he went to go scratch his nose. <laughs> but it went so wrong because he started to choke and we, we, all, we had to do first aid on Dave, our lifeguard, because he couldn't breathe he with can the breathe shaving cream on his <laughs> This is my last year I was a full like counselor, um, I remember my campers were just like the loveliest and I had, this was like the summer where I first started really like getting into uh, being very interested in like marine life and sharks and so they would always, like I remember one of my campers at the end of the two weeks she drew me a little shark drawing and I still have it and I keep it on a pin board and when she first gave it to me I cried. <laughs> I'd say I'd come back for the people. Uh, for both the staff, uh, mostly volunteers, but amazing people who, they're honestly pretty inspirational types of people, um, as well as the campers. And, you know, even in my two years here, I have seen campers, returning campers, grow so much. I've seen LITs become leaders. I've seen people, you know, change in such unexpected ways. And that's really, it's such a draw. Like, it's, Amazing. There's a, a mushroom that's grown here overnight. Mushrooms grow quickly, but not usually this large. <gasps> the spores! The spores are emerging. It's an unusual mushroom. My favorite actual camp story is from Camp Olympics because I got to be a team leader and all the other leaders were like, oh, Rainbow's team's not going to win. But guess what, guys? If you cheer on your kids and you encourage them, they will be the underdogs and they will come out on top because they will not fight with each other and they'll just do amazing things. The reason why I go back is because all the staff that circles through the camp just brings out positivity in the camp and have the kids have a great time. The kids there, you can you can have so much fun playing at games, activities, making crafts with them. It's a bundle of of activities really. Mosquitoes may eat us, but they'll never beat us, cause we're